Business is a brewing here at the Boardwalk Coffee House in Myrtle Beach. There's an increase in numbers, and of course, during the summer, it's so, you know, um, hot outside. They come in for smoothies, for ice cream, for, for anything. Barista Kathleen Larrick says sales alone are up more than 2% from this time last year. And marketing and tourism expert Taylor DeMont says that's not a surprise. The fact that uh, overall we had uh, uh, higher um, occupancy suggests to me that, uh, that some restaurants, not all, but some restaurants may have uh, experienced uh, improving demand. On Tuesday, DeMond released his biannual Grand Strand Economic Outlook, which shows the area saw more than a 2% increase in occupancy rates from this time last year. His reasons for the increase? Well, infrastructure, investment in advertising, and a little good weather uh, pays off. All this despite a very rainy start to the tourism season. The second half of the summer, all the way through uh, this last weekend, uh, made up for uh, a soggy uh, spring season. DeMont says that's because during July, most people stayed for longer periods of time. Even with those early season downpours, Larrick says this is the best season they've had in the four years they've been open. In Myrtle Beach, Mark Liverman, WPDE News Channel 15.